time to wake up. This is what you need. Entertaining and educating. It's Kenny Klein TV. Tune in, please don't delay. Entertaining what we educate. This is what you need. Hey, Kenny Klein TV. Let's go. What's up, guys? Hope everyone is having a great day. If you are new to the channel, welcome. And if you are coming back, welcome back. To break the law, that is something that auditors, criminals, police, and even us all have a choice in doing. It is something that criminals struggle with. And yes, even at times, police have this issue of some of them do break the law because we are not perfect. None of us are. Well, this auditor right here, Josh, also known as Accountability for all, he thinks he has just uncovered this officer breaking the law, and apparently he's going to be coming with receipts. Well, we are going to take a look at these receipts, and we are going to find out if they are true or not. Now, if you are familiar with accountability for all, you will know that his track record with breaking the law is, well, he has broken the law quite a bit. Hopefully, he is reformed and will not be doing that again in the near future. But let's find out if his extensive knowledge of how to break the law is going to prove to be beneficial to him knowing if this officer broke the law or not. Well, let's get right into this. You got to check out my man MAA Audit. Last month, we found this Tewksbury cop, and the only thing that he could do is make demands and act like the biggest tyrant with a badge. Okay. This time around, MAA Audit was doing a cop watch, and he found the same cop. But instead of learning his lesson, working on himself, and getting instruction from his superiors, he decided to run both of our names illegally and then use one of the oldest intimidation tactics in the book. He called us by our first name to try and intimidate us. Well, that didn't work on me a month ago, and it didn't work on MAA Audit today. Watch this cop get destroyed. He's a tyrant from the Tewksbury Police Department in Tewksbury, Mass. All right, so he's assuming that the police looked them up um, using, you know, the resources, and they're assuming it's illegally they were doing this by looking it up and then using, calling them by their um, first name. Now, why do auditors think that this is an intimidation tactic? It's really not. They're letting them know that they know who they are, and there's nothing illegal about that. And if you have a, if you find it intimidating that someone is using, using your first name, then I don't know how you even step outside your house. And subscribe to MAA Audit and tell him accountability for all sent you his links in the description. Let's get into the video. And my video with him from the original incident is at the end. Let me tell you what I have out. Sitting here chatting. Ruh -ruh. Zoinks! Jinkies! Jeepers! And the taxpayers' money. Oh now wait a minute. Wasting the taxpayers' money. Well, when you got when you auditors go out there and you go to these public places, knowing full well that more than likely people are going to um get upset, they're gonna call the police on you and the police are going to come out there. Would, would that not also be a form of wasting taxpayers' money? You always talk about how, why can't you just tell them not to come out? They know they're not going to do that because if they did do that, again, there would be no content for them. They really need to make up their mind. Either they want them to not waste the taxpayers' money, like kind of like what they're doing right now by not driving around and using gas, you know. But, hey, police just can't win with these guys. This guy's the blacked out one. You can barely see the 911 emergency on that thing.
This is the guy that drove away on us. How are you? How you doing? Not too bad. No Joshua today? No Joshua. No. Why'd you pull out like that? Why'd I pull out where? When we when we come up on you when you're playing the game. I don't know what you're talking about. You got it, you sped right out of there. I didn't speed out of there. You sped out of there. No direction, no oh I got it's on fifth. No, I'm just asking you i I'm just asking you a question. I gotta go. No transparency, no accountability, no nothing. Have a great day. Merry Christmas. Yeah, you too. Be safe. I'm not even sure he understands what all of the he was saying means. No transparency, um, no accountability. Um, what exactly does he need to be accountable for? He didn't want to be in a situation where you were there, so he left. Is that illegal? Is that against some sort of policy that the police have? Uh, that it's there that's a no on both accounts there but somehow um they feel that that is somehow wrong huh well this is his take on it next we're gonna take a look at josh's account so far i'm not really seeing a whole lot of uh law breaking What's your plan? How are you doing? Not too bad. How are you, man? Good. How can I help you? What's your plan? Huh? I'm looking for a new game to download. Something yeah. to help pass the time. What's your plan? Huh? I'm not playing anything. You weren't just playing a game right there? No. So, so we got you playing a game. Yeah. And now you're going to lie to my face and tell me you're not playing a game. I'm looking at something on an app. Yes. Oh, okay. So it was an ad then? Yes. Okay. All right. Cool. Ha <laughs> ha! So how just can I help you? You're answering my questions. That's how you can help me, man. That's okay. all. You're just, just answering some questions. What's that? Yeah, McMahon, 41. Thank you. Thanks. Sergeant, officer. Officer, okay. I always like to address people by their earned title, you know what I mean? Yep. Yeah. There's not too many ways you can turn it. You want to go around that side? You can get it from that side? Well, what are you trying to look at here? I'm just looking at your screen there. Okay, well, you don't need to be looking at it. I do. It's in public, so I'm going to look at it. You don't need to tell me what I'm going to be doing Sir, in public. You have a good day. Okay. I don't tell you how to police. You don't tell me how to public. Slow down. Right. Almost ran your foot over. Use directionals. Oncoming traffic. We're going to blow a red light, too. Now, I thought he might have had him at the end there when he was talking about running the red light, but no, 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 and lo, lo and behold, he, he did stop, and there were cars behind him to show that he did stop, so no, no, he didn't um, break any laws. Of course, he was saying, well, don't do this, don't do that, and things like this, and don't run over my foot. Well, why are you standing so close to a car that is obviously going to drive off, maybe step back when you notice he's going to drive off if you get your foot ran over because someone decides to drive off um more than likely it's going to be your fault not the driver's fault uh, there we go again two in instances with the same cop he does not want to deal with their nonsense so he doesn't he decides to drive off when he realizes they don't really need any uh services or anything like that so they leave they don't have to sit there and answer your questions they do not have to be interviewed they do not have to entertain you or be the subject of your video if they don't need to be if they are not on a call to service or anything like that i, I know they realize that and they not realize that they think that they are so utterly important and that they are the most important thing in the entire world especially someone like with an ego like um accountability for all here not too sure about his buddy but if he's hanging around with accountability for all he can't be all that great himself right 
Um, again, nothing done here that was illegal. I don't know why they claim this, especially in titles. It's obviously, well, actually, I do know, I'm sorry. It's to get the clicks and views and get their views up and all that, because we all know that it sure seems like the Audina community is dying slowly. We can only hope. Hope you guys all have a fantastic rest of your day, and we'll see you again in another video. Peace. We've only just been.